Akron detectives say 71-year-old Neil Rankin had reported crimes the last five years ranging from burglary to auto theft to fraud. But today they look for clues to find his killer. Police say after acquaintances' knocks went unanswered at the home yesterday, they spotted Rankin through windows beaten to death on his floor and then ran to neighbor Derek Mobley's house to call 911. I kind of figured it was something bad that happened because, you know, they come over here. Why would they come, you know, tell me to call 911? So I really, you know, really couldn't tell. Not many people in the neighborhood knew Neil Rankin real well, but they said he was a very kind old man, what they did know of him. Many people were always coming to the house for favors, favors he always granted. Those may have eventually led to his death. Friends say people often took advantage of Rankin. That led to his TV, VCR, microwave, and numerous vehicles being stolen in years past. Police say he may have even known and let his killer inside, as there was no sign of forced entry. The killer also likely stole Rankin's car that was later found in what police call another case of the elderly being victimized. I can't at this time say that's highly unusual, especially with an, uh, an elderly person that lives by themselves. We don't know what his health condition was, possibility of Alzheimer's, anything like that. What police do know is that finding those who victimized Rankin before may lead them to finding the killer that made Neil Rankin a victim for the last time. In Akron, Ross Kirchis, News Channel 5.